Some of my favourite animals that we encounter are seabirds. I have a real love for them. Seabirds spend their time in the ocean and it's one of my favourite places. <laughs> and uh, many of them out in the open ocean for months and years at a time. Pelicans are a little bit different because they're actually more a shorebird so they come, come ashore but they still spend time in the ocean and all animals in the ocean I'm fascinated by. They have very different lifestyle to us and I think that, um, that's part of the fascinating thing. A common reason why pelicans in particular are brought to us is because they get entangled in fishing line and hooks and it, it's really sad and many many of the pelicans and the cormorants and other shorebirds are when we x-ray them have hooks in their digestive tract and often um, have line entanglement as well not just internally but externally causing all sorts of issues they come in contact with it because they are often around um, people who are fishing and along the shoreline itself. It's a really big problem in the ocean, not just for marine birds, but for all marine life. So releasing wildlife is the best part of my job. I'm very privileged to be able to do that. And we you know, treat a lot of wildlife at the hospital and when we get to release them back into the wild, then that's just the best feeling to be able to take them back to their natural habitat and to watch them go home, basically. Great. And because this bird came from Sydney Harbour, he, he was found in the harbour, released him in the harbour. And uh, pelicans are quite mobile during the day, they fly quite long distances, they get right up high and fly over the whole area. And um, he would be used to feeding in certain spots, so we're hoping that he will go back to his normal environment and not get into trouble again. If people can be really careful to take their line away and put it you know, in a garbage bin and dispose of it responsibly, then a lot of the injuries to wildlife will, will, won't happen. Anywhere that people find along the shorelines or rivers, find hooks and, and fishing line or any garbage for that matter, any sort of marine debris to collect it and put it in a garbage bin, that would be really helpful.